بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ٹوڈے ویل ڈسکس اباؤٹ ٹائم اسپین ان سی شاد واٹ از ٹائم اسپین ٹائم اسپین ایز یو سی لائک وی آر ان دا ایرا آف سوشل میڈیا وی ہیو سو مینی آپشنز آف سوشل میڈیا لائک فیس بک انسٹاگرام ٹویٹر اینڈ مینی مور سو یو سی وین سم ون پوسٹ اینی Uh, create any post so it also displays that uh, this post was created 13 hours ago one year ago or a few seconds ago so how can we create this uh, basically this is nothing it's uh, just a time calculation when you create any post you add uh, a column a uh, field in the database that uh, on the creation of this post you just get the time of the system or server and save that in the database and uh, the next option is to write a function uh, to calculate uh, from the current date and minus that uh, created date and returns you in a string uh, the difference of that uh, date so you don't have to do that calculation because i have created a time span nugget package so how can you use this i will give you the link of this time span because many of the people have created uh, also the same thing with the same name but uh, i will provide my link so for demonstration i'm making a video that how can you use this i'm going to start visual studio all right i'm create a new project and uh, on desktop i will check it because uh, for checking purpose a windows form would be fine so from here i will select desktop web forms dot net framework next and i will just create an application Okay, it's creating my project now what I will do first I will go to the package manager console if uh, you this option is not visible to you then go to tools and make it package manager and here is package manager console I already opened that so and now just go to this and copy the command come back to the controller uh, project and let's just paste it and press enter it will install the package now it's time to check if it is installed yes it's get stopped all right so it's time to check it now let's just uh, get a text box sorry date time picker and a label to show the answer and a button to check the event okay, i'm clicking it date time picker one dot is uh, dot selected date i guess what is the method to get the date from this uh, let me check okay dot value is the property dot short date yeah or long date but all right first let's just display this label 1 dot text is equals to this First, let's just check this whether it is working or not okay as you can see it is showing this it's fine okay now let's just comment this code and uh, add the reference of that library using time span okay 
in this uh, package i have added a class which is named as date helper okay and uh, this class has an static method which is return date and it will take a date time value so I'll, how we'll provide this we'll just copy control x and control v and paste it okay and copy this command control x let's uncomment this paste okay now it's time to check this okay i'm selecting a date it's showing me that 14 days ago seven days ago okay. and when i'm selecting the today few seconds ago it's working perfect nine days ago same thing it will work uh, for time you know minutes and everything so you just have to provide the you know date time as i can you know i just change this mm. Let's just create an string, string date is equals to two slash fifteen slash two zero two one colon zero two comma zero zero. date time d is equals to convert dot to date time and let's just pass this let's make it safe and run okay Mm, this date format is not recognized for this. I have to provide a correct date format. Okay, what I have done wrong? This. You must have to make sure that you have provided the right thing. Okay, now it's 2.20 p.m. and I am providing 2.10 slash t. So I guess there is 10 minute difference. Let's just calculate this. And I click, oh, it's perfectly working as you can see 11 minutes ago. Fine, okay. Now let's just check uh, this, make it one. It's about one hour ago. Perfect, and let's make it AM and see what happens. one day ago that's perfect okay so i hope you like the video then if you really like and it makes you work easier then please like share and subscribe to my channel hope to see you in the next video love us